understand you. You've been trying to screw me into submission. I was not. You've been trying to screw me into submission, and I let you because the sex was so good and your ego was hurt. I am trying. I am trying to understand you. I am trying to know you. I am trying to love you, and I don't know how. I don't know how because you don't give me anything. Oh, so the, the vent burn was uh, you branding me? Like, I, like I'm chattel? I'm trying! I don't know you. I don't know you because you don't give me anything. I give you everything. Burke. What? Burke, Preston Burke, you were engaged. It was almost a wedding. Why didn't that happen? No, no, I'm not, we're not doing this. See, you give me nothing. Maybe, maybe I was trying to screw you into submission. Maybe I was trying to connect. I'll try anything, I'll try anything. But you have to give me something back. Well, Burke is irrelevant. Oh, yeah, like I'll be in three years' time. That's not fair. I'm trying to love you. Why won't you let me? Burke? Burke was, uh... He took something from me. He took little pieces of me. Little pieces over time. So small, I didn't notice, you know. He wanted me to be something I wasn't. And I made myself into what he wanted. One day I was me, Christina Yang, and then suddenly I was lying for him and uh, jeopardizing my career and uh, agreeing to be married and wearing a ring and being a bride. Until I was standing there in a wedding dress with no eyebrows and I wasn't Christina Yang anymore. And even then I would have married him. I would have. I lost myself for a long time. And now that I'm finally me again, I can't. I love you. I love you more than I love Burke. I love you. And that scares the crap out of me because when you asked me to ignore Teddy's page, you took a piece of me. And I let you. And that will never happen again. I am looking to the future.